When we think about automotive engineering, our minds often lead towards the more glamorous components like engines, transmissions, or advanced driver assistance systems. However, we can't stress enough how crucial clamps are in holding everything together, quite literally. Clamps serve several critical functions in a vehicle. They create airtight and liquid tight seals in various systems, preventing leaks of fluids like coolant, oil, and fuel. Clamps hold hoses, pipes, and other components in place, ensuring they don't come loose due to vibration or movement. In high pressure systems, clamps maintain the integrity of connections, preventing blowouts or failures. By securing components firmly, clamps help reduce rattles and vibrations that could lead to unwanted noise. So let's explore the two main types of clamps used in automotive applications. Worm drive and constant tension each has its unique characteristics and ideal uses. Worm drive clamps, also known as screw clamps or hose clamps, are perhaps the most recognizable type of automotive clamp. Their design is simple, yet highly effective. The mechanics of a worm drive clamp revolve around three main components, starting with a band that's usually made of stainless steel. This flexible strip wraps around the hose or component to be clamped. Then there's the housing. This holds the screw mechanism in place and then the screw. When turned, it engages with slots in the band, tightening or loosening the clamp. When we tighten the screw, it pulls the band through the housing, reducing the diameter of the clamp and creating a tight seal. This mechanism allows for precise adjustment and a wide range of clamping forces. In automotive applications, we use worm drive clamps in various systems like cooling system hoses, fuel lines, and air intake systems. Constant tension clamps, also referred to as spring clamps or spring-loaded clamps, represent a different approach to securing hoses and components in automotive systems. The key components of a constant tension clamp include a spring band, which is usually made of spring steel. This forms the main body of the clamp. Ears or tabs, these protrusions allow for insulation and removal of the clamp. A liner, this helps distribute pressure evenly and protect the hose. The principle behind constant tension clamps is straightforward, but ingenious. The spring band is manufactured with a specific diameter slightly smaller than the hose it's designed to clamp. When we install the clamp, we use special pliers to expand the ears, increasing the clamp's diameter. Once in place and released, the spring tension in the band causes it to contract, creating a uniform, constant pressure around the entire circumference of the hose. Clamps should be placed at least a quarter inch from the end of the hose to ensure a good seal. It's also important to orient the clamp so that it's easily accessible for future maintenance. Regular inspection of these clamps during routine maintenance can prevent many potential problems, saving both time and money in the long run. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you next time.